so this is the stuff I picked up from the farmer's market a little while ago. Um, onions, peppers, peaches, lemons, bananas, and corn. Um, I love corn, especially this time of year. Um, bananas were like a dollar a pound, I believe, and then the peaches were one nineteen a pound. The lemons were about three for a dollar. And these were, this was about 70 cents a pound, and this was about 70 cents a pound, too. So, all in all, I really didn't spend all that much. And the farmer's market's always an awesome place to go if you want vegetables and if you want really to get good deals on food. Um, we also stopped and picked up some dessert from for tonight. This is um, a cookie and brownie bars mix that we've never tried before. So, it looks rather interesting. Um, it looks really yummy. So... This is going to be for after dinner in a little, in a little while. Good morning guys! It's Friday morning and I need to go grocery shopping. And then later we have movies in the park for showing The Force Awakens which is uber cool. Um, my kids and I are going to go. I don't think I'm going to take Annie. I don't think she's going to be very cooperative is I guess the word I'm looking for so she's probably going to stay home with daddy while me Jaina and Lucy go out um <clears throat> they have movies in the park every year but the past couple of years we've gotten rained out and we tried to go a couple times it just never worked so with my husband being home we're determined to go especially tonight so Mm. Also, my sister and I have my mom's surgery shower planned out completely. Let me tell you what, my sister and I are on the same wing, are on the same wavelength when it comes to certain things and we had this planned out in hours. My sister has her church. Banana. Banana. My sister has. Banana. Yes dear. Banana. My sister has her church completely on board so we can use their annex building we have people bringing food we have a, a an invitation list um it's everybody a bunch of people just helping out i can't believe how quickly we managed to put this together and it's tomorrow night you guys that's how fast we put this together people are bringing mac and cheese and homemade mashed potatoes and 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 and, and, and chicken and desserts and drinks and it's just really overwhelming to see so much support from my mom and how many people are doing everything. It's just really awesome. You guys totally, totally rock. Hi guys, so just a quick PSA. Um, when you're grocery shopping, you need to watch out for these teenagers who are just trying to earn some summer money. Um, we went through, it wasn't, it wasn't a bad experience. But I mean, like all teenagers, she really wasn't paying attention and didn't want her to get hurt. What was going on was that I was turning down the aisle in the, in, in the parking lot to park my car and another guy was behind her. She was just beside the car so nobody could really get through the park. I did not see her until I pulled into the road to park. So I had to back up, put my car in reverse and come out so I can let her get by and she was so relieved the look on her face was like you know thank you very much but watch out for these kids because a most drivers suck and don't pay attention like the guy who was trying to drive beside her and teenagers just don't pay attention sometimes I mean they're teenagers their brains aren't functioning <laughs> um, to their full capacity so just please watch out for kids because it, it makes me mad when people don't watch out for kids all right I gotta run in get some food and hopefully get some stuff for my mom's party tomorrow. See you guys in a bit. Hello. So my sister and I, we're grabbing stuff for my mom tomorrow and we don't get out too much at all. Um, where's my key? You see what happens when her and I get out? We just stop thinking. Um, we tried to go out the wrong door on the way out of the store. Wonder why it couldn't open because it was an entrance door not an, and not an exit door. <laughs> you cannot stick two of us together. 
at the same place, things probably will go awry. We're smart. <laughs> yeah, we're totally smart. We're super duper uber smart. Shut up. Oh, there you go, you're good. <laughs> Anything to say at all? Um, going to college does not make you smarter. <laughs> Necessarily. She's right. <laughs> She's absolutely right. This so it's movies in the park. The and they've got Force Awakens showing for free down at the park. So of course we gotta go. Jaina's on my right, Lucy's on my left. Annie is at home oh, with Dad. Um, they have a huge screen out here. I wish we could play at the same box. No, you can't play because they can't play in the park because the movie, the screen is actually on the other side of the park. There's no way I can watch them from where we are. So, we're just going to have to sit tight for a few minutes. A few minutes? Tell them yeah. Mom, can you that is the screen. We're pretty close up to it. The park is actually getting kind of full. There's my kids running around. There's people playing volleyball. There's a dog barking. There's the concession stand behind us. Um, people are starting to come here. So, yeah, see you after the movie. Hi guys, it's about 7.30 Saturday morning and I have to really rush. We didn't get home until about 11.30 last night. Um, I got, I guess, okay amount of sleep. The kids went to bed immediately after we got home from the um, park. But I have to work today and then immediately after work, I have to get my mom's stuff and take it over to the church. Um, so I'm gonna be rushing and rushing and rushing. Um, there's like a 30 minute time gap in between when I get off of work and when I'm supposed to meet my sister because my sister is gonna unlock it and um, turn on the AC for everybody so she's supposed to be there at 4 30 I get off at 4 I have to rush 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 back home get changed um, get my kids out the door and get my mom's stuff out the door so I guess we'll see how that one goes. So I'm on my way home from work. Um, I'm at a red light in case you guys are wondering. Um, I have to rush, rush, rush. I have to rush home, get changed, get the stuff loaded up, grab my kids and husband and head out. Um, I'm sure you guys are gonna see tons of stuff. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So this is some of the decorations my sister threw together really, really quickly. I mean, she goes all out. We're starting to get food in. We got the music over there, speakers and all. The tables decorated. And more people like coming. This basket is for writing encouraging notes or anything nice you want to put down. It says right here. Um, just write down, you know, a nice sweet message and she'll read it in a little while. So let me show you guys some of the pictures that my sister put up. This one in particular is of my brother, my mom, and me. And I look like Jay Nut in that photograph. Show me. It resembles so much. There? There's me. And there's Jaina. <laughs> me and Jaina. <laughs> and there's another picture up here of my mom when she was a little baby. That looks like Jaina too a little bit. So that's pretty cool, huh? Um, all kinds of pictures of her family, us kids, us her sisters. There's a picture of my grandparents up there, my grandma and my granddad. Um, my sister, when she was little, that almost looks like Annie a little bit, which is going to focus. It's not going to pick up very well, but she looks like Annie when she was little. 
And here's more people coming. How was your trip? It was fun. Awesome? It was really great. I'm just tired. You're tired? Yeah. Yeah, it. Come here. You know how they do. You know how Grandma has a bat in the house? I know about the bat. <laughs> They got her a bat so everybody can sign. Oh, Isn't that cute? It's yeah. a wooden bat. It's the old Louisiana slug. No, yeah. I know about the bat. She used to <laughs> pull it out when someone knocked on the door and we didn't know who it was. <laughs> but she got one for everybody to sign. So, I mean, this is not like the sweetest thing ever. <laughs> My mom is due to come in any second now. Look at all these people. All these people are here. More are coming. Tara, move! Hi! Our turn, we got your back. Yeah. That is so cool. Yeah. Who came up with that? Okay. Travis did? You did? I realized what it was, that's when I started laughing. The reason why there's a story behind this, a lot of people don't know. Me and Richie was getting into a fight with a couple of kids across the street trying to protect you. And uh, I think I remember that. And what happened was here comes mama coming out of the house with two wooden baseball bats. <laughs> Aww. Ready to rock and roll. That's dead. I think I remember that. He yeah. put his arm to a door. I got one more thing. <laughs> yeah, honey, I, I, I sing a bat in a heartbeat. I know you would. I have three <laughs> in my office now. Come through that door one time. I know you would. Thank you so much, sweetie. You You're welcome. did a great job. I'm glad you like Thank it. Thank you so much. Hi, everybody. Here, hang on. Hang on, hang on. There we go. It's gone. Are you having fun? Yes, I'm having fun, Abby. I'm having so much fun. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. Did you get enough to eat though? Yes, I did. I got a lot to eat. I got a lot to eat indeed. Yes, I did. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> what? What did she write? What did she write? Probably uh, the driving for. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It's <clears throat> Sunday morning, Father's Day. Um, I have my father. I'm going to have a stepfather, so happy Father's Day, guys. Um, speaking of Father's Day, my mom gave me some stuff that belonged to my dad when he was in the Navy. I have um, his Navy ring. I have an ID bracelet she made for him with his initials on it. I have his Navy decorations, um, some other odds and ends. I have his dog tags, too. So. Those are neat little treasures that I will cherish and take care of. I already have them <clears throat> put away in a safe place. So they're in my possession and they will stay away from little fingers until the time is right, you know, for them to understand stuff. So yeah, happy Father's Day. Um, getting ready to start breakfast. First of all, we stayed up late watching a movie and I had such high hopes for this movie. I have read the book Cell by Stephen King about five times, okay? I read this a few years ago when I was on bed rest for Danny. Um, it's such a good book. The book is amazing, okay? 
Um, if you've read the book, or and if you haven't seen the movie, turn away now. Go away. You've been warned. Um, first of all, the movie doesn't even begin the same. Um, the main characters, Tom, Clint, and Alice, don't even meet up in the same way. They get to the um, academy where they meet Jordan very, very, very quickly. They meet Ray very fast. The ice cream chuck isn't even in the beginning. It's closer to the middle towards the end. It doesn't even end the same, and it was totally, totally butchered. <clears throat> the book is very, very awesome. Very great. So when I heard they were turning it into a movie, <clears throat> I had extremely high hopes for the movie. Nope. I feel totally gypped and totally cheated. Uh, the book is wonderful. If you want to go read Cell, go read it. It's fantastic. It won't let you down. It's one of the best books I've read by Stephen King in a very long time. Um, it rates maybe, to me anyways, maybe in the top five of all of his novels, okay? Um, my favorite book by Stephen King is probably The Stand. The Stand is absolutely wonderful. Um, then you have Desperation, which I can't remember the, the, the co-author. There's like two authors who wrote Desperation. Stephen King was one of them. Um, Desperation is really good. Another movie that bombed, by the way. They, they, they made Desperation into a, a, a mini TV movie and it sucked. Sucked big time. You can't do movies like that and expect to rush it. it it's horrible. Um, let's see. Of course, you know, the classics, It, Cujo, Christine, a few others. Um, my first Stephen King book that I read was Carrie, and I actually read it when I was about Jaina's age. And I fell in love with it. I fell in love with the genre. I, I fell in love with horror and mystery and all that good stuff. So, um, but yeah, so it was a total letdown. Okay, it was was horrible. It's it. They rushed it. They rushed it. They rushed it way too much. And it was no. It. It doesn't work as a movie. It, it could work as a movie, but they just cut out so much important things that it's not even worth making it into a movie. And they changed certain important scenes around. So what's the point of even making this into a movie? It just doesn't. It, it doesn't work the way they, the way they portrayed it, and it doesn't even end the same. Wait, and it no. Let me get off my high horse. But um. We have Father's Day plans, and my husband does not know, okay? So I have to, once again, after work, I have to work today too, after work, I have to rush home, be here at a certain time, is my AC kicking on, be here at a certain time so somebody else can show up at a certain time. Whew, I can pull it off. We pulled off yesterday somehow, some way. I don't even know how we managed to do all that work within two days, but we did it. You guys rock. You guys seriously rock. Um, so, besides, let's see, what happened yesterday? Oh yeah, um, not two minutes until arrival, Annie fell, scraped her knee and her elbow. Um, she was okay. She really didn't notice it all that much. She screamed for maybe a, a couple seconds, but she was fine after that. Um, Lucy got dirt in her eye. Yeah, that was lovely. She screamed bloody murder. We couldn't figure out what was wrong until we noticed dirt in her face and dirt in her eye. We got it out. She's fine. Don't worry. She's okay. Um, but my mom had a good time. Um, lots of food, lots of people, lots of family, lots of friends. More people showed up than I anticipated. That was awesome. I was pleasantly surprised by how many people actually showed up. But I have to go make, um, breakfast and I'll see you guys after work because I want to upload all this tonight. So yeah, I'll see you guys after work later.
stuff why I, I have to try to, <laughs> to go and pack this part myself. It's fantastic that you, you spend this work. Though records are scarce, Richard's ancestors in India left a rich array of traces behind. At the age of 63, Richard's second great grandfather died in Madras. We were able to locate his tombstone. Take a look at this. Rick agrees. <laughs> So I'm rushing around again. I got the crazy lady here going. Um, had to go to get off work. I had to go get milk, and then I had I'm um, just trying to get home so I can get everybody out the door on time to meet my daughter. Originally, she was supposed to come over. Plans changed because she wanted to include her sisters, which is awesome. That's totally awesome. But, um, so I have to rush home, rush, 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 get everybody ready and out the door. Um, pizza. pizza. And, yeah, pizza. And Annie was getting a little overwhelmed. Um, I have her in the car. We're kind of just hanging out and letting the other kids and my husband and my son-in-law finish their meal. Um, Annie verbalized she was getting overwhelmed, which is really cool. Um, she said she's getting tired and she wants to go home. And, yeah, no, stay right here, baby. Mama, look. Where do you see an airplane? I, I can't do. Even, Oh yeah, that's so cool. It's way up there guys. It's there's an airplane. I barely saw that. How do you see that? Dada. That is inside still baby Dada. There's an airplane way up there and she spotted it You saw it <laughs> Your little eagle eyes It's an airplane It's an airplane Yeah, it's in the sky. That's right It's a helicopter airplane? Okay. <laughs> but we're just hanging out. Um, just waiting for everybody to finish up. Yeah, I know. Stay over here. But she, you could tell it was getting that time where she was just getting too, there was just too much commotion, too much noise. She was getting overwhelmed, overstimulated. Um, Lucy seems to be doing okay. When we first, came in, she was kind of aggravated, come here, over here babe, and she was kind of aggravated, but she kind of weaned in and she was fine, come on, see over here babe, but um, Annie lasted long enough to eat some pizza and dessert pizza and that was about it, so I'm just waiting for my crew to finish so we can go home, it's been a fun Father's Day, um, I rushed and rushed and rushed and rushed. Oh, Annie over here, huh? No, no ma'am. Stay your butt here. <clears throat> I rushed and I rushed and I rushed. All weekend long. It's gonna be nice to come, uh-uh. Just to kind of sit back for a minute. You wanna go that way? We can go this way, come on. We can get in this side. What? Open. Open the door. Wah. Okay. Go ahead, get in. Uh, but um, no. Well, get get in. But it's gonna be nice just to kind of get back and relax tonight. And I will see you guys when we get home. Um, it's after ten o'clock. We've obviously have been home for a while. I just didn't realize. It was this late because I was trying to jump on some things and get some stuff done um, before we went to bed and I guess time just got away from me but I gotta get everything uploaded and processed before I get it uploaded to YouTube and next week is gonna be pretty busy but I'll try to keep you guys in the loop as much as I can and as best as I can and 
I uh, hopefully if I don't see you tomorrow, I'll see you guys next week. Mama, no. Hope you guys have had an awesome weekend. Um, hope you guys have had an awesome Father's Day to all your fathers out there. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.